something's wrong. I, I came in yesterday and got liposuction. I know people think it's odd, especially since I'm a guy, but I've always had this self-image problem. My father wasn't the most understanding of men. This morning there was a smell by the incision. Around noon I started feeling strange, and then I just passed out. Everything was trying to tell me something. I think you look just fine. Really, I do. Please, don't make me hideous. Please. <gasps> I'll never understand why people do this. It's me. <gasps> We are who we are. That infection is getting worse by the second. He is totally pale. We need to find out what's causing this infection. Oh, you're wonderful, doctor. People really shouldn't mess around with nature. I just don't get this whole liposuction thing. I just don't. He's up and running. Is that going to make me beautiful? Please, don't make me hideous. Please. Well, <laughs> what's done is done. <laughs> I can feel it working. I don't think he's going to be in any after photos. Ah, oh, much better. Yes, as far as I know. I found him in the Yellow Pages, and at his office he had all these little wonderful before and after pictures. Everyone was just so beautiful. I felt cold and was shaking all over, and the next thing I knew, I'd black out. I've hated the way I've looked for years. Other people don't know what it's like when they're born perfect and beautiful. Your liposuction patient is doing well. Smart move, getting a hold of infectious disease. Keep up the good work. You know, evaluations are uh, not the most enjoyable part of my job. <clears throat> With everything that's been going on here for the past three months, all these riots and whatnot, uh, this hospital has been under constant scrutiny. And a lot of our doctors, I'm sorry to say, have crumbled under the pressure. And they're no longer with us either by their own choice or with a little nudge from us. Now, coming from a very sheltered uh, environment as you have, you could easily have been one of those doctors, but you weren't. You worked hard, you cared for your patients, and you kept your composure under very trying circumstances. So you're doing wonderful work, doctor. I want you to keep it up. Thanks.
You blew me away. I've never seen anything like that before. Vanity. The lengths we will go to to satisfy our vanity and the trouble it can get us into. But we're all subject to it, aren't we? Why, I myself have seen a plastic surgeon for. Uh, no, perhaps I shouldn't say. We don't want any nasty gossip getting around the residence now, do we?